In this series, we're going to be building an MVC framework, on top of which we'll also be building a social network. So before we get started, let's just have a look at some of the functionality that this social network will have. Now, before we do anything, let's just sign up quickly for an account, I'll choose a username, a password, and I'll just put in a dummy email address, sign up, perfect. And let's sign in quickly. Great, so now we're signed in and we can see our timeline. Now in a, in a different window, I'm going to create a new account. We'll call him John, we'll create a password for him and we'll give him an email address and then we'll sign in with his accounts like so. Okay, so now we have two different accounts open in our different windows. We can update our status. And then we get redirected to our profile where we can see our status. We can reply to it. We can see our friends and all this kind of uh, jazz. And it also shows up on our timeline. So if we go to our friends, you can see that we haven't actually added any yet. So let's fix that. Let's search for that other guy that we just created and let's add him. And you can see that we get this success message saying a friend request has been sent and this button turns into a disabled, uh, well, a disabled button. And if we go back and hit refresh on our other account, you'll see that we get this little bubble in the navigation bar. That means that we have incoming friend requests. So if we just go there, we'll see a list of all the friends that have sent us a friend request and we can accept or decline. Now, if we go to Terry's profile, we can also uh, handle the request here. So back to our friends list, let's accept this request. And if we go back to our other account, hit refresh, you'll get this little message saying you are friends. Now let's post a status under John's account. And hit refresh in our other timeline. And you'll see that uh, John's status shows up. We can also reply to this. Hello, John, how are you? And that's that. So now we've had a look at some of the functionality in this uh, social network or this application, let's go ahead and start to build it. 